Hello everyone and welcome to our new video. Most of you ask us about our feature that is very useful for the charts and that feature name is chart grouping. Alexander is here with me as always so we will show you today how you can enable this feature and show uh, data differently on, in your charts. So Alexander we can we can start. Okay so um, we've got a basic table that consists of names and uh, values so for example look at this table like an ordering table where George ordered uh, something uh, two items then four items then two items again then John ordered three items then six items and so on so you want to create a chart where you want to group all those values together for each individual so here we create a chart say chart grouping and select for example high charts basic column chart and click on next then we select this table click on next and select these two columns uh, you can enable follow table filtering if you want to add the chart and the table on the same page and then you want to filter per person so here we click on next and we can actually see that these are all well doubled not doubled but as many times as George is in the in the table right here that's how many bars you're gonna get but if you enable grouping you will see George with the total value of 8 John with total value of 9 Paul with total value of 6 and Ringo with 11 basically that is it when you save the chart you've got it um, configured and you can add it to a page um, along with the table if we want to filter the table for someone so let's say chart group add the chart then below that we can add the table let's just copy the short code and paste it here let's publish the page and take a look at the front end so here we see the chart we see the table and if we say john the table will be filtered and the chart will also show only john's entries okay. so you can for example maybe display two charts uh, well, but without the grouping and to, to display the same table differently in, in, two, in two charts yes you can create another chart which will not be using the uh, grouping feature so if you want to add another chart that looks like this you can simply create another chart and uh, save it and then add the short code to the page to so have two charts showing same values but one is grouped while the other is it's all not. values in the table okay that's basically thank, thank you alexander <laughs> you're welcome thank you guys short one for today hope you this helps you out and let us know in the comment section below if you use this feature or have, you, have any issues using the chart grouping. So, okay, thank yeah. you very much. Um, uh, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. See you in another video. Take care, guys. Bye. Bye bye.